tonight, there's been a shakeup at the State House. Worcester Democrat Harriet Chandler taking over as the acting Senate president. The emergency move comes hours after Stanley Rosenberg announced that he was stepping aside. Good evening to you. I'm David Wade. I'm Lisa Hughes. Rosenberg's husband is accused of sexually assaulting several men, and there are now two investigations. Tiffany Chan has more on the state of flux at the State House. The Senate elected Senator Harriet Chandler to serve as acting Senate president during the investigation into Senator Rosenberg's husband, Brian Hefner, who's been accused by multiple men of sexual misconduct over several years. About eight hours after Senator Stan Rosenberg agreed to step down as Senate president, a new leader emerges. The circumstances that have led to this election are unprecedented and they're unfortunate. But choices had to be made. The Senate elected Senator Harriet Chandler of Worcester to take over during the investigation into allegations of sexual harassment against Rosenberg's husband, Brian Hefner. Minutes after the vote, Rosenberg released this statement that reads in part, During my leave of absence from being Senate president, I look forward to a thorough, fair, and independent investigation. The Attorney General and Suffolk County District Attorney's Office has launched a criminal investigation into the allegations. This investigation needs to take as long as it takes, and it needs to go where the facts take it. According to Mass Live, Hefner is accused of sending an unsolicited nude photo to someone who works in state policy. Politics. This new claim follows allegations made by four men to the Boston Globe that Hefner sexually assaulted them over several years. As the investigation unfolds, Chandler is urging victims to speak out. There is zero tolerance, zero tolerance in the Senate for retaliatory behavior toward anyone who comes forward. The Senate Ethics Committee will also hire an independent investigator to determine whether Senator Rosenberg violated any Senate rules or knew about any of these sexual harassment allegations. At the State House, I'm Tiffany Chan for WBZ News.